Good morning, Ax. Good morning, Getting Power. Here I am to start with you in your first cup with a class. Dun, 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 dun. Before we start with the capoeira, I would like to tell you guys that I'm in a uniform because as a capoeirista, the uniform has a huge significance for me. It is extremely important. When I use my uniform, it brings me to the understanding that during this class, I'm going to have to follow some rules, okay? I want to share the rules with you guys before we start. Here I have a computer with me that will help me with that. The first rule is always show respect to your teachers and training partners. Okay? Keep fingers and toenails trimmed for everybody's safety. This shared responsibility with the parents. Parents, I'm looking at you too. Students should use the restroom before or after class when possible. No burping, spitting, farting. Mm -hmm. No fart. Oh, please don't touch your face so you don't spread germs around. Or excessive grunting, distracting noises. We will continue to share more rules with you guys later. I want to remind you guys about Jose before we start your class. Remember Jose, born to dance? Mm -hmm. You're gonna be looking like Jose right now. And Jose is this story, telling book that I'm sharing with you guys. That was written by Susanna Rage and illustrated by Raul Colon. And remember the capoeira movement, capoeira music? One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, that's an exercise that you're gonna have to do with your parents or anyone who is responsible for you. And here is the pandero, the tambourine. If you don't have one at home, just use Jose. If you guys can see it, I put four rocks and I made a 16 square foot area. That means it's one, two, three, four, 12 inches in a foot. One, two, three, four, four, right? One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. There you go. And you know, before we start the up with the class, you have to do our warm up. During our warm up, we're gonna use the name of animals, okay? As a warm up. Let's start with jacare. I'm gonna turn sideways so you guys can see my body. Okay, jacare. Remember, you only have 12 foot. You're gonna count four seconds. One, two, three, four. Then you're gonna do cobra. You're gonna open your legs. One, two, three, four. Then you're gonna do tigre. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Then you're gonna do sapo. You're gonna look at me. You're gonna do kangaroo. One, two, three, four. Uh-huh. Now, your body, it's almost ready to start with the capoeira movements. Now you're gonna warm up your upper body, your core system. One, two, three, four, and one, 
two, three, four. Now you're getting ready for capoeira, right? Before we start with the capoeira movements, we're gonna now do a little running. I'm going to do a little running. I want us to use the cup in the center of the square. How are you gonna find the center of the square? Hmm, good question. One, two, three. Oh, okay, so three is the center of the square. What is that? It's math. One, two, three. Uh -huh. Geometry, right? One, two, three. Move over here. It's okay to adjust the car. One, two, three. That's the geometry right there. So you got it right. You got it right. You want to do a little running? Your parents are going to come to you running for one minute. I'm only going to do 10 seconds. Okay? When they say change, change, you change. That means... When they say change, if you change, that means you are a left. Change. Squat. Squat. Okay. Now we're gonna get to the basic steps of capoeira. We're gonna put the cap right in front of us so we have a reference point. And we're gonna put legs in a parallel line, okay? Your right leg, my right is gonna be your left, okay? You're gonna put your left leg back, I mean, put my right leg back. Your right arm in front, and you're gonna come back front, you're gonna switch arms, and you switch your leg. Leg, leg, switch, do um, dois, 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 um, dois. This movement is the basic and most important movement in capoeira. It is called ginga. Can you say with me? Ginga. That's right. Ginga. Our next movement is, you're gonna, now, you're so close to the cap that you're gonna kick. You're gonna take one step back, and you're gonna do the kick that we used to do in our class. Remember? Kick, um, dois, três, quatro. You're not gonna worry much about your arms right now, okay? You don't just worry about your kicks. Your arms are gonna come automatically. As you kick, okay? All right? Okay. There you go. You're gonna do 10 kicks. Our next movement is you're gonna do the movement that we used to do in class. Got engaging. Put your hands down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. When you stand up, I was like a capoeirista with a jinga, with your arms protect your face, and you're gonna smile at the end of the class. <laughs> I had so much fun, Mr. Elio. Thank you. You're welcome. Don't forget about our music. Capoeira, we always end with music. One second. Ah. I play and you sing. Oh, sing, sing, sing. Oh, now, now, now. Oh, sing, sing, sing. Oh, now, now, now. É o A, é o B, é o A, é o B, é o C. La la e, la la e, 
la la e la la e la 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 e la la e la la e la la e la salve and i can't wait until i see all of you guys with some capoeira pants i'll see you soon love you and stay safe be well thank you